Hello everybody, this is Gold Glee Gamer 1 and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door Remastered. Alright. Well, now it's back to West Rogueport again. Because it is time to talk to Don Pinata. What? However, wait. I say that like I'm like I'm not looking forward to seeing him. Oh wait. No no no, I'm not supposed to be here. Ooh, a crack in the wall? I think I know what that means. Bobbery? Do oh, wait, no, no, not there. Bobbery? Do your stuff. All right, and we up. Ooh, a shine sprite, okay. I thought it was going to be another way into Don Pinata's area. Oh no, it's an item shop. Oh, actually, that's pretty good. So I kind of need to stock up. Life mushroom. Okay. <clears throat> oh, wait, 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 wait. Do I gotta go this way? I, I was so sure I remembered which way to Don Pinata's area. <clears throat> oh. Poor boss. That big man's been sick with loneliness ever since his daughter skedaddled. Our underboss, Frankie, is gone. The boss is in shambles. What's a syndicate to do? That scuffy gang of punk thieves is stealing jobs from us left, left, right and left. Hey, but enough about us. What can we do for you? What? Tickets for the ritziest train around for the XS Express? You want tickets for that rolling wing ding? Ooh, ain't nothing we can do about that. Yeah, giving us... That's giving out... That's right. You gotta talk to the boss for that. I just can't stand seeing the boss like this. Only we could help the boss see his daughter again. Hang on. Those two friendly folk, Frankie and Francesca, from Keel Hall Key? Now, what? Now, what did you just say? Repeat that. You know where the young Miss Pinata is at? Really? No lie. I swear to you, if you're lying, I will turn you into confetti, so help me. Now, if that's where she is, why don't you bring her back here, huh? Be a pal. We go ourselves, but we can't leave the boss unprotected. You got me? You bring us young friend Miss Francesca. And we'll bring the boss. Someone to do something here. Deal! Yeah, now that's better. I knew once you'd understood our predicament, you couldn't refuse. Don't screw this up! Yeah. Alright. Okay, so looks like we gotta go back to Keel Hall Key yet again. Let's go to Key All Key. Yes. Again, to see we go. You now that station, Keel Hall Key. Oh, 
Oh, wait, we can skip this? Oh. Uh, <laughs> actually, no point. Okay, we're back at Keel Hall Key, yet again. So east of the shanty town, so up oh, they're here. Oh hey, it's Mario. How have you been there, pal? We do something for you? What da boss is sick? Oh poor daddy. Oh no, and at a time like this? You see, I, I just dropped the wedding ring Frankie gave me around here. Can't possibly leave until I find that ring. Otherwise, someone may eat it. May eat it. It must be somewhere in between here and that skull rock. And then for a second, my fuzzy little coconut. Shouldn't we forget about that ring for now and go check on the boss? How could you say that, Frankie? That ring was a symbol of our love. We have to find it. We have to. Or maybe just you just don't love me anymore. Is that it? Of course I love you, my little bacon burger. None of your sweet talk now. You're going to have to say you love me 100 times. <laughs> oh my god. If you love me, you have to say it, Frankie. Oh my god. Should, should we keep count of that? <laughs> no, at least. Okay. You have to say it. 99 more times. <laughs> Why, are you dizzy dame? <laughs> oh, what? Oh, he's actually going to do it. <laughs> he is actually going to say it 100 times. Wow. Keeping count. We're going to we're going to keep he, he is actually going to say it. <laughs> It's hit all those times. Oh my. Oh, what? I can't help but laugh. <laughs> wow. It, it's like she's making him work for it. Okay, that's it. Okay, it's a hundred. There, I said it. Oh, Frankie, you're such a silly Billy. <laughs> now, my little cream puff. Let's find that ring right away. What do you say? I say, oh boy, don't, don't you think these two will be quite all right by their lonesomes? I shouldn't think so. We should help them. Okay, well, where is that wedding ring? Near the tree where you help Bobbery. Let's see. The hard part is trying to remember. Remember what tree we helped Bobbery at.
Bravo. All right. Ha! No, oh boy, he just stole some flower points. Flash to fear. Up. Uh, wait. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna go this way. No, I'll, no, I'll take the trampoline up. I'll save a lot of time by doing that. No, 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 I, no, I don't want to deal with you. Okay, it had to have been somewhere around here. I, I would, I would want to think. Oh, wait, is this it? <clears throat> Got the wedding ring. Okay. Okay. If you can't reach that, but oh well. That's it. That's it. That's the ring. That's the ring. You found it, pal. Thank you. Now we can go home to daddy. <clears throat> we sure can, my little cheese and cracker. Let's go. Also, anyway, we'll be down at the dock. Hurry back, please. All right. You heard them. Let's go. I think we're ready, pal. Yeah, yeah. Let's go back to Rogueport. Mm -hmm. Hang on until we get there. Alright. Alright, need to go back to Rogueport? Yes. Alright, we are off. Cast off to Rogueport. We have to go see Daddy immediately. <clears throat> you got it, Francesca. All right. Well, we know what we do. Follow them.
Hey, wake up! Open your eyes! Boss. <laughs> That's Francesca? Hey! Boss! Oh, my little Francesca! You came back for me! And you too, Frankie! Of course we did, Daddy! As we heard you were ill, we dropped everything and rushed back. Francesca, Frankie, I was wrong. I was a stubborn old man. Forgive me. I know I may regret saying that, but I want the two of you to stay here with me. I can't bear to be away from you two lovebirds. I'm an old man now. I need peace. I guess the time has come for me to stop being so selfish, causing everyone trouble. Like even Don Pinata, a Don of untimely death, can't escape an old age. The time has come, everyone. I'm gonna retire. No, oh, it's time. I mean, and I want you to be my successor, Frankie. What do you say, Frankie? As of today, you are the new head of the Pinata Syndicate. What? But boss, you still got it in you. You're a spring chicken. You don't gotta do this. And I mean, me, boss? No, you're the one, Frankie. I've been thinking that for a long time now. It'll do just fine, kid. I got a feeling about you. A good one. I want you to take care of Francesca. Boss. <clears throat> Alright, it looks like you've done yet another favor for me, kid. Yeah. <clears throat> about that, boss. It, this is gonna be just beautiful. I know it. What do you guys did you guys do? I promised him something. We told him that we asked you about a ticket for the Excess Express. Whoa, ho, 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 ho. is that all? You had me worried for a second. Come on over here, Marl. How many do you want? One, two, ten. Help yourself. Ah, uh, ticket. To Poshley Heights. You can come back anytime you like. How about that? Well, now that I've retired, I'm going to get out of here. Daddy. Boss. You're the boss now, Frankie. You got that? You, the boss. You do good now, Frankie. Frankie, we got lots of work to do, and don't worry, I'll keep you in line. Wait, Bean, come on. Knock it off with a pet name nonsense, will you? Call me Francesca. Huh? Huh? Francesca? Or Miss Boss. Dee hee hee. Under Boss. You got our loyalty. We'll be by your side whenever you need us, Boss. Thank you so much, Mario, for everything. You're welcome in here anytime. You're like a brother to me. You ain't bad, kiddo. You want to think about joining up with the syndicate? It's the life, kid. Golly, good show. We'll reach Poshley Heights in time for tea, eh? Finding that sixth crystal star shouldn't be more taxing than a vacation. Hey, what? I heard that, my uglies. So that sixth crystal star is in Poshley Heights, is it? That's a rather nice piece of information. Thanks ever so. You're Beldum. Normally, this would be where I finally deal with you and that sappy traitor Vivian. But something tells me that trying that alone might be unwise. So you live for now. Instead, I'll just beat you to Poshley Heights and get you to hit that crystal star before you do. <laughs> we'll see about that. I suggest we reach Poshley Heights before that crone. 
We're alive, man. We are off to Rogue Port Station. Yep, let's go. All right. <laughs> and we're going to stop here for today. So until next time, this is Gold League Gamer 1. Later, folks.